Woody, Buzz, the pig that sounds like the mailman from Cheers. Good eye, my prickly friend. These characters have entertained us with their movies for years. The video games based on those animated classics? Nah, eh, not so much. But that doesn't stop the powers that be from coming up with yet another movie-based game. And that's why we've got Toy Story 3, the video game. And yet, surprisingly, or not, it isn't the worst movie-based game we've seen. And we have seen a lot of them. It's a harmless little romp through the Toy Story world as Buzz, Woody, or Jesse. There's two modes in the game. The first, Story Mode. With eight tiny levels of platforming and collecting and leaping, Plus light your mission log. there's not much here to hold any sort of attention span, even if you're a toy. It's the Toy Box Mode that held our interest. Based around the Wild West of Woody's Roundup, this is where Buzz can take in the sights while taking on silly little challenges, like getting a hat for one of those alien types. All the collecting here will make it possible to go to Owl's Toy Barn and purchase something special. It's fun to look around in toy box mode and explore the space. You know, really explore the space. Spruce up the buildings. Make it your own. This is the part of the game that makes Toy Story 3 all worthwhile. Which, if I can say, is seriously impressive. Sure, Toy Story 3 skews young, but older middle-aged gamers who like to wear hats backwards also like Toy Story. They'll also want to play this game. It is Toy Story. It is Woody and Buzz. Sometimes, that's all we want. We do wish the game was as good as the source material. It's still safe, innocent entertainment. Ah, but what could have been? Let's hope we haven't seen the last of these toys in the world of video games. The potential is great. Toy Story 3 the video game gets three infinities and beyond out of five. Good eye, my prickly friend.